Hey, it's L. Hagerty from Comic Element Productions. We're going to go over a tutorial on how to get better effects and transitions on Windows Movie Maker. Check out our channel as well as my channel at www.youtube.com slash comic element productions and youtube.com slash L. Hagerty 1. I'm going to be going over how to get better effects and transitions on Windows Movie Maker XP as well as Vista. So let's start off. U using Windows Movie Maker XP, you can get thousands of extra effects and transitions from windowsmoviemaker.net slash forums. Also, if you go to movies.blainsville.com, it gives you uh, great general tips on filming and editing using Windows Movie Maker. But this page here is really what you're going to want to look at to get the extra effects, transitions, and to find out how to actually put them onto your personal Windows Movie Maker program. I'm just going to give a link here explaining on how you actually do that step by step. Now using Windows Movie Maker Vista is a little bit differently. You can actually add your own effects. What you're going to need is you're going to need Rehan FX Shader TFX for the uh, Vista version. Uh, it's a free download from uh, www.rehanfx.org slash shader his main website is rehanfx.org uh, it's, pre it's pretty good it says it has advanced chroma key I wouldn't say it's really advanced if you're looking for advanced stuff you're gonna get different programs I'd say it's just basic chroma key it's also got PIP picture in picture and splits video which is you know two videos at once it also has gradient wipes slash SMPTE wipes based on gradient images. Uh, it got custom overlays and borders, which I'll go over in another video. It also got color masking, uh, color pass filters. The download itself, uh, you can download for free or you can pay for it at the same time as you download. I think you can only pay for it using PayPal. Uh, you can pay for it at any time, whether your trial's finished or it's just begun. Uh, when you first download Rehan FX Shader TFX, you uh, get 30 day free trial. You don't have to take the free trial. You can purchase it right away or you can wait until it's done. Now, what you have to remember is after your 30 days have passed, you get a pop up about registering your Rehan FX product. Uh, when you initially use a shader, Rehan FX Shader tool, it'll ask you to register. After that, it won't come up again until you restart your computer or something like that. After the free trial, some of the tools are unusable and some are still usable. I would suggest you do purchase Rion FX product as it's only 15 bucks. Uh, I believe that's American. I have uh, used PayPal in the past uh, for eBay and other services and it's, it's pretty good. It's one of the safest ways of paying over the internet. Uh, here's a link for the PayPal Buyer Protection Act. It should protect you pretty well. If you use Windows Movie Maker, the Rehan FX shader is a huge addition to the Windows Movie Maker program. But if you're looking for something more for your editing, or if Windows Movie Maker just doesn't cut it for you, I would suggest the editing programs if you're an amateur, Cyberlink PowerDirector 7. If you're decent, I would suggest Sony Vegas's Movie Studio Platinum 9. If you're an expert editor, I would suggest Final Cut or Sony Vegas Pro, the latest versions 9, and Adobe Premiere. I'll be making more tutorials on how to actually use the Rehan FX tools and what editing programs, special effects programs I recommend and why. Thanks. See ya.